So finally you have decided to learn Scala now, amazing decision. So in this video we'll talk about how to learn it. So welcome back, this is Navin Reddy from Studies for Learnings and now let's talk about how to learn Scala. But before that there are certain prerequisites, right? So first prerequisite is, I mean in, in terms of knowledge and the second prerequisite in terms of softwares. So let's start with the knowledge first. So to learn Scala, so in this series, I will be assuming that you know Java because I will not teach you what is variable. I, know I will not teach you what is loops. Okay. So we'll be using those stuff directly. So I'm, I'm assuming that you know Java, uh, at least I'm not saying in the expert level, but as a beginner level, you should know what is for loop. You should know what is array, how do we create an object, how to use collection and what is thread. So if you know all those topics, at least basics of them, you can learn Scala. So those are the prerequisite as per knowledge. If you don't know those, those things, that's okay. You can go back to my channel, learn Java a bit. Uh, you can go to the play playlist and watch some of the videos to get the basic understanding how Java works. And then you can jump into Scala. So that's the knowledge, knowledge prerequisites. What softwares you need? So before installing Scala, which we'll be doing in the next session, in the next video. So before installing Scala, your machine needs java so first first of all you are, you have to install jdk in your machine uh, because it will make sure that you have jdk and you have jvm updated version of jvm so that's the first thing second you need eclipse okay because what we'll be doing is we'll be installing a plugin of scala in eclipse again you can use scala you can use scala on command line you can use scala inside eclipse you can use scala inside netbeans IntelliJ or you can download this Scala IDE itself okay but we'll be doing Scala with Eclipse so before going for the next video you can download Eclipse and you can keep it ready so that's it two requisites first first a knowledge requisite and then sec software in knowledge Java is required I mean the knowledge of Java is required and the second one the setup of Java is required so that's it see you in the next video thank you so much